Hey there, Gemini, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, overcast and super pensive today for the Geminis, maybe even a subtle chance of being angry at something. I'll talk about why the moon has now moved into Pisces. So your emotional focus, your emotions, will be on career and legacy for the next two and a half days. And that said, remember last month, you were kind of working on your awareness and your perceptions of what your career and legacy will be. Well, this is, excuse me, almost the emotional follow through of what you learned last month. So you might have process that you need to change jobs, but today you really feel like you need to change jobs. Your emotions are coming along that learning. Now, if there's anger today or potential conflict, it's probably due to the moon crossing over Mars as well. Remember, Mars is our focusing agent of aggression, masculinity, and kind of where anger crops up in life. And so when the moon crosses over Mars, it kind of asks your emotions to let off steam. Okay, so you're being encouraged to let off steam. And we do want to let off steam. We don't want to let anger harbor, because when anger harbors in our consciousness, it will come out a certain way. It'll come out in an accident, a car accident, a physical accident, an argument, a fight, violence, you get drunk in a bar. That's Mars all trying to let out that, mas that masculine uh, energy. So if you've been harboring any sort of resentment or anger or something around your career, you'll probably be triggered today. Now also adding to today's chaos with the spiritual earthquake, the sun in Aries ruled by Uranus. Now, if you're new to Soul Garden, you probably don't realize Uranus is the big bad wolf of the solar system. It huffs and it puffs, and anything built out of straw will get blown down. So the topic for Geminis this month is your social life. I don't know if you realize this, but Aries is the energy that gives us strength, period. Wherever Aries is in a client's chart, I know that's where they feel strong in life. That's how they gain their courage in life. Geminis as a race get all their strength and courage from having a good social life. Geminis must be social. They must be out with the people. And that makes total sense because you're the messenger. You can't give a message by just sitting in your house alone. So this month you're going to be working on your feelings of strength by looking at how good your social life is. Are you out there being the ambassador? Are you getting to be messenger? Because that's when Geminis feel strong and confident. So with Uranus ruling the day, any aspect of your social life that's not working or built out of straw, so to speak, likely will get blown down. So just try to step back, don't get too angry with the moon on Mars, and take note. These are the areas we're going to work on repairing when the sun moves into chapter two. All right, Gemini, that's all I have for Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow with Shout Out Wednesday. Live, love, be. So